Yo. I think I got this set up just in time. So losers round one is up next. Uh, uh oh, I'm worried for lack of game audio again. Yup. Oh, I've been working on the bracket image all day. Boom, there we go. Uh, I'm also predicting the future a little bit. So winner of this is going to play uh, whoever lost between Steez and Boodled, which I assume is Boodled. Ooh, jab reset from Beef? Okay, Beef definitely the best nest to ever roam the island. Dang, strong back air. Didn't take his jump, though. I thought I saw his jump get taken there. Uh-oh. Oh, he's got to, he's got to be... His tude's ready? Okay, no big deal. I think... I think you can just, like, counter up B. Oh, dang. Beef messed up his angle there. No big deal, though. So, yeah. I, uh, Ikea's gonna have to play the loser of Big Money Gorb. And since Big Money has won every event for the... Whoa, what the gimp in progress? Uh, what the... Oh, twos, you should have been ready. You should have just let it rip immediately. Holy! Ken combo? Five forward airs? Oh, dang, disrupted by that Psy rocking that forward air. I just saw Dr. Swellman's video about the, the new Earthbound, like, no minute world record that just got set. Seemed like a ridiculously lucky run. I thought it was, like, a new route, but, like, no, it was just, like, cascading good luck throughout the whole thing. Whoa, Beef kind of falls into Tude's lap and just dies the down smash. Okay. Dang, I wasn't expecting this. Oh, dang, we really are missing game audio. How can this be? It's just like, crossbar just misbehaving? Okay, now it works, what the heck? Uh, huh. I think it's just like, uh, the, the game audio goes quiet on character select, and so like, my my thing just stops listening for game audio, I guess. Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, ooh, look at that. Shield grab, uh, thunder pursuit. Oops, Tude's uh, tournament winner's onto the platform and gets no punish. But he wave dash ins and down smashes like he's, uh, you know, Prince Adam deals with the situation. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Forward throw into nothing. I guess beef DI'd away? Is that supposed to work? I'm sure Tudes knows all sorts of stuff about the, the Marth Nass matchup. It's grinding grinding on ranks so much. I wonder like how many Nesses are out there on unranked. I wonder how big like Slippy unranked even is. Oh platform drop getting punished big time there by Forward Smash. Casey bat. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay, they're coming down. Man, everyone... Toots is just like the, the ultimate face of the scene. Like, every, everybody loves him. Everyone says he's the best player on the island. I think if anyone can heroically take down this tyrannical beef nest, it's gonna be Toots. I think beef got third last week, actually. <laughs> or like, like top four. Did surprisingly well. Like, with ride or die nest, too. Or no, wait, it wasn't the, it wasn't last week's MeSpace event, it was like the, the online, uh, either this Monday or like the week before. Oh dang, jumping over that little Casey bat. Ness isn't even fully grown, he's not very tall. Meanwhile, this guy Marth, he's, he's Prince of, uh, what is it, Silesia? No, that's a real, that's a real kingdom. What the heck is Marth's kingdom called? Man, Delta would just like, be on me in an instant. Delta would know it instantly. Whoop. Dang, the movement. How are you gonna compete with Tudes' movement, though? Oh, what the? Maybe that's how. Just, just let it rip. Just hit that F smash. Uh oh, big stomp. Oh, what the? No follow up after that follow up. Uh, full hop back air. Huh? I thought that. I thought that was gonna be a Johnny stock. Or that too, like the DJC up air. What the heck? Oh, the thunder juggle getting missed. Wow, that, that home run bat might have done it there. Uh oh. Oh, oh no. Man, that dash attack just doing nothing. Two's just like crouch cancels it and fares out of hit stun. What the? How did Slow get up not getting beat by that? What? Forward error? Beating every Marth option? Two's just didn't hit a button. Okay, stop him. What? Two's, what's, what's going on? Look at, I looked at the webcam and saw Two's like flex and like lift 400 pounds. Like both his arms jiggled real big time there. He's like, oh, he's trying so hard. What is this three stock comeback? Oh, wait, wave dash DI. It's good enough. He's just side B's again. He's on land. Oh, wow. <laughs> Crazy first game. 
the old gods and the new gods rising out of the soil to do battle. Dang, what an event. This is a privilege to cast this one. Wait, what? Oh, I thought I heard, I thought I heard Beef say FD. But like, no, don't go there. That's Toods' home turf. That's his favorite level. What the? Counter on nothing, getting punished with one tick of dash attack. Okay. Oh, another dash attack. Dang, that's a high risk, high reward move, like most of them, I guess. It's a pretty good launcher if you hit it just right. Unfortunately, you're launching into Ness moves, which are uh, incredibly nerfed compared to 64. Just says this game has so much less hit stun than 64. Oh, dang, the PK fire to spook him and keep him on the ledge, so his. And he almost saved him with the Thunder Node, but pulled it away last minute there. What a villain. Yeah, that's... The point of melee commentary is to tell stories. It's definitely a Tuesday the hero, beef the villain here. What the... Oh! Ha, villain getting his uh, worthy dessert pastry there. By forward airing, he did not grab the ledge and immediately perished. He freaking perished, bro. Okay, oh! <laughs> Elegant. They dash in, they dash out. They're like both dash attacking the space where they just were there. Street Fighter 6 just came out, we're all playing footsies out here too. What the- oh, that, that get up attack sucks, getting punished there by Beef's downer, but nothing else. Back to Nucci's, a lot of dash dancing. Oh, wow, look, that's all it takes. Beef's legendary combo, the, the anything for back air. Not anything into back air, it's like, we'll do anything to get back air. Uh, oh, okay, I, I like I like what Toods is thinking there, like going for the, the cape. You know, the, the legendary Marth offstage drift. Oh, that's a classic one. Down throw forward smash. 69, by the way. Oh, yeah, I think that, I think I heard the crowd bring that up at the exact same time. What? Oh, getting out of the down throw praha by platform dropping. Oh, dang. Tudes used his boost, but he's uh, safely above the center of the stage. Uh, forward air gets coach canceled, but he finds a grab anyway. Beef just not ready to to act out of that crouch cancel. Well, okay, DJC Nair, and, uh, but Tudes doesn't bite. He ain't a rat, he ain't a fish. There's gotta be real bait on the hook. Gotta be a nice... Gotta put some actual cheese on there, Beef. Don't just have the raw hook. Two's not one to take a bite. He's the one to take a bite out of you. Look at these jaws. These sharp teeth. Oh, I thought he's gonna get pineapple there. I thought he was holding inward a bit much. Yep, he's early. Uh, beef busy getting up, doesn't get pu doesn't punish there. Okay, oh, gentleman? Wow, Nessa gentleman way better though. See, I think he's forward airing out of double jump like that in order to. Oh, well. <laughs> Two's just forward B's to. Or, yeah. To face the correct way and grab the ledge. Yeah, per pursuing people off stage with the Thunder Note is fun, but, like, look what it does. It sends them upward. Look, he just saved them. I think he was, like, trying to execution test Toods. Like, if. Because if Toods was holding inward, he might have, like, flopped into the wall and missed his tech. Well, even, even still, like, you hit the wall with Marth, you have to, like, wall tech without doing a wall jump tech. And then, like, up B at the correct time, or else you just die. Like, Mars wall jump tech, he, like, pushes himself too far away from the ledge to actually come back with up B. Oh, okay. Oh, look, he's got the better grab range, Beef. <laughs> His grab getting whiff punished by Toods' grab. Okay, dang. Sweet spot fair. Beef going way off there. Uh, down tilt not working there because Beef gains a bunch of height from his double jump. Yeah, I see him. He's doing double jump forward air to contest uh, forward smash. Wow. Tudes KOs off the side at 209 with a strong forward air with the, the sweet spot. Okay, yeah, he's, he's side being, he's jumping, he's getting out of there. He's moving fast. He's looking for short hop two forward airs, I guess. Yep, yeah, it worked that time. Okay, coming back down. Doesn't L cancel that. Beef shield grabs him. Oh, what the? Was that like... Where's that fire coming from? It was like down throw, but then he like got jab resetted. Oh, it happened! It happened! The up B to lure Marth to his demise actually worked. I wonder like, what is, I wonder about Beast's motivation there. Is it, is he, is he like, this is optimal Ness gameplay? Or is it like, uh, I'm disrespecting my opponent? Like, does he think it's optimal? Or is he is he doing it for like uh, morale damage? Tudes not going to FD? Unbelievable! I've never seen Tudes pick a level other than wait. Well, Stadium wasn't allowed. I guess that was Beef's ban, but he didn't say Final D. He wanted to say Yoshi's. I, he doesn't want to deal with Ness's recovery. Ness's recovery is too good in 2023. After like 15 years of Marth Edgeguard development. We finally just gone all the way around, back to Ness's recovery is good, actually. Yeah, see, the forward air, the forward air keeps denying uh, uh, Marth S-Mash, because, like, it's it's good, but it's not that fast. 
it's like he sticks his chest out while he's like hauling the sword from behind him. Like he sticks out a hurt box before the sword crosses 12 o'clock and is actually defending him. So Beef's super fast forward air is like preempting that. I mean, Toots can still F-Smash, he just has to like time and space it better. He has, to, he has to do it in such a way with awareness of Beef's counterplay to it. Uh-huh. Okay, tournament winner at over 100, not getting punished. Okay, here we go, down throw. F-Smash, but the F-Smash is too slow. What the, okay, d counter him, or, or just let him fall. Wait, what the, he can grab the ledge looking the wrong way? Okay. Oh, dang. And, oh, but Beef messed up his angle. Okay, it worked anyway. Toots having a giggle about it. Who's doing the morale damage now, he says. Oh, what the? 64 combos, DJC up air to up tilt to another DJC up air. Okay, now we're juggling in a back air. Toots uses his boosted side B, but controls the ledge. Makes it on the center stage. Now he's comboing back with two fares into a down tilt for 27% and nothing else. Oh, what the? Wow, the startup of his smash attack got preempted by Beef's forward smash. Tie battle right now. It's Wow, it's real tight. It's like exactly equal. Uh, forward air into like four down tilts. Uh-huh, okay, dash attack, Toods, DIs, and Techs away. PK Fire doing nothing. I don't think that move is gonna hit a Marth. Did you know Marth becomes invincible when he dash dances? Like, look at him, he, he turns into, like, wacky waving, arm flailing, inflatable tube man. He can go from, like, 30 degrees to 60 degrees bent over in a single frame, and then once he's actually dashing, he's like an armadillo, like, so... He's, like, the same height as Ness when he's dashing. He becomes so tiny. It's so OP. I'm so... I'm so sick of Marth. Fakest character in the game. <laughs> we still rather fight against Marth than Sheik. I'm just saying, like, I think Marth is vastly overrated. I think Beef has come here to prove that. Look at that. He doesn't even get tech chased. He's just like, nah, bro, I, I recover too quick. What is it? Is it is Tude's, like, not frame perfect? Like, not acting as... Oh, wow, I thought he was just going to win right there. Oh, what the... He walks off facing the wrong way. Okay, does it again. Sour spot, though. Beef's feet touches the ground. He's got... Oh, wait, he's got his double jump to... Yeah, cancel with. To attack with. Uh-oh. Uh, oh, he's living! For how much longer? He can't... Oh, dang. I thought he'd reach. GG's Beef goes 0-2 this week. Unbelievable. The hero, too, has come to slay the Esper Menace.